Hello and welcome to GCSE Guided Choices for Drama. We follow uh, at Martin High School the EDUCAS uh, exam board here and you will over the next two years be studying similar to you do at Key Stage 3 but taking that knowledge further. So the exam is br broken up into three components. Component one is worth 40%. And it starts in the summer term of year 10 and it is examined in the autumn term of year 11. During this time, you will create your own performance and you will be asked to draw on that knowledge of practitioners and genres that you have studied, choosing your favourite and using the exam syllabus to create your own work. Here you can see is a performance based around um, Gecko. You know, and the however hard you try, it will always come back to haunt you. the performance that they had just created was based around the style of gecko and they continued to then complete some coursework based on this performance the next component is worth 20 percent. it's component two and this is a performance from text you're about to see a performance um with that three girls did based around the play called teachers by john godber again this is where you show either your technical skills so your design skills that can be sound lighting costume um, or set design and or your performance skills um, these girls chose to all be assessed on their performance I live close to the school but I couldn't really go to the local pub because it was always full of sixth formers I didn't know whether to be their mates or tell the landlord they was underage so I spent my nights indoors listening to Janice Ian and Dire Straits and wait to see if I got an interview from St George's during January, Shine seemed to go off Nixon. And when we heard that he was applying to somewhere else, we drifted away a bit. But we still had a laugh. Um, one day in January, asked to do a play about corporal punishment. So us, draw Hobby, me and Gail did this thing about school killers. Right, so in the staff room there's a phone, like a bat phone, and it glows really red when someone's on the other line. Oh yeah, and under each desk in every classroom there's a buzzer, so if a teacher gets into any trouble or has a cue to get a jockey, they can press it and the phone will ring. Right, in the staff room, sat about all day drinking coffee, reading ancient books of these ninjas. <laughs> Japanese martial art experts were trained to kill kids with karate chops and sharp stars that they throw. And in the staff room are these wires, so when these ninjas get the call, can jump out of the staff room window and land at the room at the ceiling in seconds. Right, I'm the French assistant and I'm teaching. I'm Rachel Steele and I throw something at the board. Who was that? Who was that playing missiles towards my eight? This is very dangerous and could be bad if somebody gets hurt. Was it you? Russian, what this? You know what? No, I don't. You frog. Okay, so that is component two. Component three is where you learn about a text. This is a written examination in the hall and is based on an hour and a half. You also have to watch a piece of live theatre, which is also evaluated within this component. Um, it is mainly practical work that we do within the lessons, studying the text and looking at things like that. But there are, there is written work that you have to complete. So if you are interested in creating your own work, looking at the GCSE syllabus that we studied in year key stage three, and you've been excited by that and enjoy that, then obviously GCSE is very similar. So it will be something that you will also enjoy. Once a half term, there's also the opportunity as much as possible to go and see a piece of live theatre, which obviously will help with your component three as well. So if you are looking for a career that uses communication, teamwork, uh, concentration, then drama is for you.